A great advance in the early 1900s was the development of decent sewage systems, and that actually saved lives, especially of children. So we began to see a more what we call vertical population structure, where there, if there's less child mortality, then you see more and more people who survive to adulthood, middle age, and old age. One reason we're seeing more elderly people is that younger people are surviving better, and the current 100-year-old population came through the era where advances were made in both uh, water supply, obstetric care, and other aspects of medicine. By the time these people were in their 60s and 70s and 80s, when heart attacks become very common, we began to develop good treatments for heart attacks in the 1980s and 1990s especially, even in the 1970s. So middle-aged and early old-aged people were dying less from heart attacks. So all of these things happen during the life course of people who are now 100.